Astronomers first observed light behind a black hole. For the first time, astronomers could look behind a black hole and see the light coming from the other side, this proves Einstein's theory of general relativity. Using powerful telescopes, a team of international researchers observed the eruption of X-rays from a massive black hole 800 million light-years away. This black hole is located in the center of a distant galaxy. In addition to the usual signs of a black hole, the researchers also observed light during their research. This light was an X-ray emitted from a distant part of the black hole. Black holes are usually born when a large star reaches the end of its life and black hole forms following a supernova explosion. In the next stage, this celestial body reaches the stage of collapse. Such a process creates a dense substance that swallows everything around it and adds to its mass, thus making it impossible to observe the light behind the black hole. However, in his theory of relativity in 1915, Einstein predicted that the gravitational force of black holes would be so great that it would spin around space, bend light and change the surrounding magnetic fields. As a result, in the theory of general relativity, it was stated that it is possible to observe light emanating from the distant part of a black hole. Because the black hole's magnetic field acts like a mirror. Researchers have not yet been able to observe this event directly. But now, with the help of modern telescopes and the development of highly accurate instruments, it has become possible to observe this event. Dan Wilkins, an astrophysicist at Stanford University, studied how atoms and electrons are separated by black holes and generated by X-rays. Examining the information, he found that X-rays erupted from the center of the black hole toward Earth. In addition, he witnessed an unexpected echo of light after the event. The light echoes were shorter, and their color differed from the previous bright lights. Any light that goes into a black hole does not come out of it, he added. So, we cannot see behind the black hole. We can now see this phenomenon because the echoes of the light were X-rays that were thrown in the opposite direction of the Earth but were reflected towards us by the black hole's magnetic field. This finding again demonstrates the validity of Einstein's theory and supports the theory of relativity. Fifty years ago, when astronomers speculated about the behavior of magnetic fields near a black hole, they did not think there was a way to observe this event directly in the future, said Professor Roger Allen Ford, one of the study's authors. But technology has once again proved Einstein's theory of relativity.